What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Dr. Nina, and as the seasons change, I like to get back into detox mode. Yes, full body detox to make sure that I'm taking care of my gut health, my body care and products I choose to use on my body, as well as weight loss and fitness strategies. I like to make sure I refresh all that to get the most out of my body. So today I'm gonna share the daily habits that I use that maybe you'll incorporate into your day, but also share some of the things you use down below. I'll also be leaving the links to all the products I'm recommending, as well as other things. Let's get into this. One of the best and the simplest methods I've added for daily detoxing is trying to blend in gut balancing spices in every way. Look y'all, I've done so much research and I've learned so much about spices that work well for gut health. And I'm all on board with adding spices in to food that legit helps my gut and my microbiome. Things like garlic, turmeric, and ginger, they're not only good, but they work well for the gut. They are thought to help rid the gut of harmful bacteria, and they may even assist in reducing inflammation inflammation. They also won't hurt the good bacteria in the body. And when I don't want to cook with these, I just add them to tea or even water with lemon. Simple. There's some major daily detox go-tos that I have to have around. Y'all know I love a good smoothie, including things like spinach, kale, spirulina, and ginger. And they're all great for detox, but I love fresh juices as well as making them myself. Honestly, the greener it is, the better off I know I'll be to cleanse my body and give it nutrients. And getting all that can be hard, but y'all know I love my yay or organics for this. I've been rocking with them for years and to get a good skin glow detox, I add a cup of alkaline water or nut milk, tasty greens, their mango and carrot sea buckthorn skin glow, ice and shake for juice or blend for a smoothie. Not only is it delicious, but the greens have a combo of the chlorophyll, vitamins, minerals, phytonutrients and soluble fibers for that digestive tract. And the skin glow promotes radiant skin and hair packed with beta carotene, good for the eyes and the skin. If you're wanting to get that daily detox, and nutrients in like me i got my link down below and my code dr nina 10 for 10 percent off for trying yay organics another small thing that helps me in the morning and the night is sipping a little hot water and lemon or some green tea also just simply adding a little apple cider vinegar with the mother to water or to meals which is said to help with the detoxing process as well hydrotherapy changes the game for me whenever i can take it and i've shown y'all a version of this when it comes to my hair washing switching between hot and cold temperatures but it can be many things. A simple way to do hydrotherapy daily is by alternating between hot and cold water every 30 seconds in the shower. So cold water stimulates causing blood vessels to constrict while the hot water relaxes and causes blood vessels to dilate. This can improve elimination and help with decreasing inflammation, reducing waste from tissues and stimulating circulation. And it's all right at your fingertips. So that's the best part. Now y'all know it can get real extra out here. So I try to make it a habit to eat foods that support healthy detoxification and gut health. Our livers and our kidneys work so hard to filter the body and to release waste. So I try to eat as healthy as possible at least five to six days a week to help things work out and move smooth. Y'all know exactly what I mean. So I try to include foods that naturally help with that cause. So garlic, lemon, lime, broccoli, spirinella, chlorella, dandelion, root, wheat, grass, broccoli, brussels, cabbage, greens, nuts, plain Greek yogurt, which I use for everything and fiber, including those apples, beans, popcorn, berries, avocado, and whole grains. I try to make sure that I include or cook with fresh veggies and fruits, which serve as nutrition for bacteria in our gut. Besides just food though, I know that there are key ways that have helped me lose weight and maintain that in support of my overall health. And now there's solutions that assist with this like found, who I'm happy to say is partnering with me to bring you all today's video. So what I love in the discovery of found is that it's the first weight care solution that has created personalized treatments around every factor that makes us unique. So I'm talking your biology, medical history, mental health, existent lifestyle goals, and more. And you know that's what I'm about teaching and showing you all the time. From my own weight loss experience of 100 pounds off, I understand that the weight loss industry is always reducing a person's success to just diet, exercise, and sheer willpower, but we know it's way more than that. Found walks the walk because they 
make healthy, sustainable weight loss a reality through an individualized look at six key things. That's medication, nutrition, movement, emotional health, sleep, and social support. And that's so key. And even the Mayo Clinic makes it clear that the combination of weight loss, medication, and lifestyle changes results in greater weight loss than lifestyle changes alone. It isn't about bad dieting or overnight success. That's not what we about over here. But found is the first weight loss solution to address you as a whole person. And they understand as most of us do how hard it is to lose weight and that for most of us, just dieting, exercise, and sheer willpower alone, they're just not enough. Take Found's health quiz and start your weight loss journey today. They even offer a 90 day money back guarantee to ensure that you're happy with the result. Just click the link in the description below or go to joinfound.com forward slash pages forward slash Dr. Nina. Did you know that a big part of detoxing is related to keeping your teeth together? Yes, it's all related to your gut. I don't play about my teeth and research shows that bacteria from your mouth can get into your stomach and cause major problems. I brush and floss my teeth regularly. Having dental checkups and cleanings are more important to a healthy microbiome. I make the effort to brush, I floss fully and tongue scrape in the morning and at night. And this cleans the mouth and the tongue of all that accumulated bacteria bacteria and debris and gross stuff and your breath smells a lot better for it so people around you will thank you as well so some of y'all out there my og viewers know that i swear by dry brushing and though i forget to do it sometimes i have really picked it back up so before showering a few days a week i dry brush my whole body i have a little brush set that i use that's detachable and i'll link it down below i do this head to toe using very long strides going towards the heart always going towards the heart it's used in some cultures and thought to be safe it's said to activate the lymphatic system stimulate blood circulation and enhance elimination through our body's largest organ that's the skin i will also say that my skin feels and looks even better softer and tighter and more glowy when i use it to add to this i get massages they can increase circulation stimulate the lymphatic system and remove buildup i just feel cleansed when i'm done so over the years i've taken y'all on a journey of really detoxing through the products that i use and i'm not perfect but before i knew better i would use so much junk on my body and over the years i've learned to research everything and that includes includes my facial care, body care, and those skincare items. I like to make sure that things that have direct daily contact have less unnecessary and foreign ingredients that could hurt my body. And this includes my deodorants, lotions, hair care, and self-care items. Some of these things have a lasting effect and could cause damage to my overall health, so I'm careful. And even some of my washes and lady washes include those opportunities to support a healthy microbiome. So I used to complain to y'all all the time about how much I sweat and I I sweat terribly but you know what I had to think carefully and closely about what sweat does for us and what it does for our body and though I knew this I realized that it really is our natural detoxifying manner it helps us get rid of toxins in the body and when I had a little too much salt or alcohol I retain water or worse I just get constipated I'm just gonna be real here we grown both are temporary conditions that could cause us to look bloated and pack on the actual weight and I know the difference but exercising and properly hydrating afterward it really helps to eliminate those toxins and get things moving across the body. And I make this happen by aiming to work out before my first meal. And I've always told y'all that I like to work out in a fasted state. And that means that I get to burn more energy from the fat that my body already stores. And this can burn almost 20% more fat compared to exercising after you've already eaten. So you might wanna consider it if it works with you and your doctor. So a simple part of my day when it comes to getting in that daily detox is thinking about some of the larger things I try to avoid. Yes, I like to have fun with my food and y'all always see me eating fish over here, but there's certain types of fish I try to avoid. And I bring that up specifically because high mercury fish is something I choose to avoid. I limit a lot of tuna, mackerel, marlin and grouper, and even shark and swordfish if you want to get fancy. So larger fish usually have higher mercury levels. It's just plain and simple. So I usually stick to salmon, barramundi, and cod the most. I also avoid high levels of artificial sweeteners, refined sugars, processed foods, alcohol, and my beloved caffeine. So I hope y'all have enjoyed today's video and have found some new motivation for how to detox daily and take the best care of your body that you can. Make sure that you comment, share this video with someone who can use it, and subscribe. Thanks so much for watching y'all. Beautiful brown baby doll. Peace.
check the links in the description for my free and new Dr. Nina's Mentorship Facebook group, which is a group of like-minded individuals looking to progress, grow, and support one another along the way. The Now That's Life podcast is about to go into season two, so I suggest you go ahead and subscribe to the podcast on all your major podcasting platforms. All descriptions and links for that and my free Supernatural video course are found below. Thanks so much for all the love and support over on my new website. If you haven't already, go ahead and check it out and join me for new ways to interact with me, giveaways and prizes, weekly emails, as well as my free eight day supernatural video course, which is free when you sign up.